welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing part two of reviewing lip glosses and I'm pretty sure this is the last part. I may review Honey Star lip glosses but I don't know yet. So let's just get on with this. I ordered three and I got two off of Etsy and one off of Amazon. They're the NK lip gels or glosses. I don't know. I got clear strawberry and cherries. So let's try them out. So I got the first package and I opened it because I didn't know what it was, as you can see, but it's all wrapped, so I don't know what it looks like. And I'm not showing you the other side, but, you know, information and stuff. So let's open it up. Okay. Oh, there's a paper. And I got this from, um, this one was the one, no, this one was the one from Etsy, and like, look how cute the packaging is. Okay, just look at what this is. Okay, so this is the strawberry one. This is just like the toy one and everything. I got this for $5.67. This is what it looks like. It's very packaged. Sorry for the background noise. The washer's on, so yeah. Oh my goodness, I see it. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm super excited. Oh my goodness, it's actually really big. I'm always expecting these to be smaller than they actually are, but yay! So this is the strawberry lip gel. I'm gonna open it up. Alright, got it open. So I am super excited. Like, look at that. It has the thing on it so it doesn't leak. Oh my goodness, you can see the top, it might have leaked, I'm not sure. Let's just open it up. Yeah, so it did get kind of in the cap, that's fine, I'm not really bo bothered by that. But look at the applicator, I was not expecting that. So let's try this out. It smells like strawberry candy, so let's try. Okay, so this is me with just a little bit on. It smells so good. Like, you don't understand. It smells like strawberry candies. I'm like, I love it. But it does leave a super good gloss. Um, It's not too thick. So if you've seen part one. As I was saying, if you've seen part one, I got the lip oil, and this is definitely thicker, so I can tell it is a lip gel, as it says. But I actually really like it, and I feel like it doesn't taint your lips, but it brings out the color in your lips, if you know what I mean. But yeah, that's the first one. I love it so much. So far, that was worth basically $6. All right, the second one, I'm not showing you the information. <laughs> yeah, so this one has two in it, the clear one and the... Uh, cherry, so. Okay, so this came with the total price for these two was eight dollars, and I was like, wow. So I paid six dollars for this one and eight dollars for them, but it's fine because if I would have added this, it would have been like four extra shipping. Okay, so I got thank you in it so yeah that's how you can see she sells her own lip glosses as well and I was thinking about getting them but I'd rather have these okay. all right let's get into this okay so they're not as wrapped as the other one clearly here they are oh my goodness is that satisfying okay so Yes, there is a big bubble, but I don't think that is her fault because she doesn't really make these, if you know what I mean. And then this one has a smaller bubble. This one's the cherry, and the difference in color can barely tell. I don't even know if you can see on camera, but this one's darker, the cherry's darker. 
So let me go get the strawberry off of my lips and I'll be right back. So I could definitely tell the strawberry was very moisturizing, but it does kind of leave an after on, like a sticky after. So I'm gonna try the clear one now. Now the cap, this actually looks way better than the other one. Oh my goodness, that comes out. So it's so glossy and it makes my lips feel so smooth. And it, I feel like it isn't as thick as the strawberry one. I don't know if that strawberry one was like in the heat more or whatever, but yeah. It doesn't leave any like scent, so that's good, not like a bad scent. And these all have vitamin E in them, so that's good. I absolutely love this one. It's actually really smooth on my lips and not as sticky as the strawberry one. So then again, it does leave like a sticky after, but I think that's fine. If I were to wash my face, it'd probably come off. So the cherry one, I'm so excited to see what this smells like. Oh my goodness. It smells exactly like the Haribo or Haribo um, cherry gummies. It smells just like that. So here is it on and on. It definitely still smells like it, but not that you would taste your lip gloss, but it does not taste like anything. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. It's super glossy and I think these were definitely worth it. Here they are. Okay guys, that's all for today's video. Thanks for watching and I hope you liked this review of them. And I definitely would think these are worth it. So if you want to order from the same girl I got mine from. Her name is Fierce Butte, so F-I-E-R-C-E-B-E-A-U-T-E. -E -E. Go check her out on Etsy. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you would like me to do a part three review of Star Honey Glosses, comment down below. Thanks for watching. Subscribe down below and share this video with your friends and make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Bye!